In the year th 3000, I think there would be <laughs> floating cities and... Okay, I'm not gonna lie, robots are awesome. Robots, flying cars. A lot of cubism, the boxes kind of thing. Pizza? Like, no more pepperoni. Maybe in the future, girls won't care about so much how they look. Santa is gonna look different. He's gonna have longer beard, like reaches to his toes. I think birds will be the only thing alive. Because first started with dinosaurs, then came us, and probably next is gonna be birds or trees. 2670? I'm gonna be really older, when I'm seven now. So I'm gonna be like a grown up. Human beings are not born like a fish. Fish has the knowledge of how to survive in water by birth. The fish just needs to grow. Creativity is a human natural attribute. Everybody has the ability to be creative. That's the fundamental of human beings. And because we're given that freedom in our classrooms to be able to inspire that, it makes Country Day a very curious and creative place. <laughs> so what we're doing in this improvisational work is setting those connections where when kids get into more complex problems and, and such later on, they already have that roadmap. You know, we don't negate other people's ideas. Kind of like, oh, well, that's kind of interesting. Let's think about that for a second. And that may take us somewhere else. And when we look at founders of Google and Apple and innovative companies and such, that's what we're seeing more and more. A lot of things that we're creating have never been built before. So if you think about like Uber, or you think about the Facebooks, the Googles, when companies come to us, it's usually because they're a leader. What is their next big move? Where are they going into? Well, that's what my team does. We want people to be in an environment where they can do their best work. What My Country Day does so well is it's really thinking out of the box. It's realizing that how we educated our kids in the past is not how we need to educate them in the future because that's not how they're going to work anymore. I think when you find happiness in work and home and schooling, that's when you get become that fulfilled human being. Safety first. What happens is that every school says that, every parent says that, but they always add something, but you got to have the basics. So I'm really saying that stop fixing children's deficit. Let them run away from their weaknesses and towards their strength. In a new society, mediocrity doesn't work anymore. But unless somebody has strength and wants to work on that strength, they cannot become great. But mediocrity really has no value in the future. Mediocrity was what we pursued in the traditional education when you have assembly line workers. In the future, if you're not creative, you probably are not able to make a good living, whether by finding a job or creating your own job. We're working on 21st century skills. And at the end, I started adding color pencils because they made the structure more stable. Our children, you can basically teach them to lament on the disappearing past, or you can help them to develop the confidence, the desire, and the passion for creating a better society for them and their children. Ooh, I think, I hope cars could fly. I hope so, because then there would be no traffic and that would be amazing. <laughs> In 50 years, oof, that's going to be in a long, long time. I would want to build flying cars. Self-driving flying cars. Hoverboards. Clouds getting higher. 50 years, I am probably going to be, I don't know, I don't want to do math right now, but I'm going to be pretty old. A teleporter that uh, wherever you want to go. Like when I miss my mommy a lot, I wish that so badly. Creativity means like, the quality of having an imagination, trying new things, coming up with new ideas. Everybody has creativity. Miami Country Day School have taken that and they've made it incredibly sophisticated in the service of children. Creativity has to be a treat of success today. You have to be creative today. And if you're not creative because there are so many other people who are creative, it's, it won't work. Creativity is the seed to my success. Without it, I mean, I wouldn't be doing anything. Nobody should expect to have jobs in the future. So we need to invent the future, not fix the past. A really good education is the foundation from which you build your career and build yourself as a human being. When I graduated from Country Day, I felt like I could conquer the world. <laughs>
I think Miami Country Day, more than anything, gave me a huge support system to express, to imagine, to put your fingerprint on anything. Now, I think it's given me more confidence to go out on a stage in front of thousands of people to create. All children should have access to this kind of education at Miami Country Day. All children should.